Okay, hi, it's Ed Winslow, and in this video I'm going to take you real quick how to update uh, your blog and uh, also how to add a new event. So I'm going to take you step by step. Okay, if you see right up here in the top, uh, the first thing you want to do is type in your domain name, um, and then you want to do a forward slash wp-admin, and then click enter. Okay, once you click enter, this is where you're going to be taken and then you're going to type in your username and password and click login. Okay, in this one, this is where you're going to be taken. This is your dashboard. And the first thing that we're going to do for this one is we're going to add an event. So we take our mouse over events and we can access existing events or we can add new. So let's do that. We're going to look at existing events. And this is where you come. Now if you want to edit the event, you can click here and you click edit and it's going to take you to this page and on this page you can type in your title right here okay you can here's your bold feature italicize uh, you can use bullets and numbers you can align your content to the left right or center right here is where you can click to add a link or you can remove a link and here you can underline you can center the, you can justify the content and right here this button here is where you can add your photos so if you click add media it's going to take you to your media file okay now you can add your content here you can type it in you can make it bold and you can put your photo wherever you want the best thing to do if you add a photo is put a your little mouse cursor where you want that photo to appear now in this case what I can do is I can add media I can click this button and then I can scroll down here on the right and if I want it to appear on the right I can click right if I want it to appear in the left of the content I can click left or I can do it in the center or I can choose none okay and here's the size so you can size it any way you want okay now let's scroll down a little bit further and you can see here's where the content appears. Now if you scroll down to the bottom of the page, this is where this is what Google sees. When you do a Google search, this is what you see. In this case, the first line is called the title tag and that's right here. Okay, right down here. The meta description is what you see right here. Okay? And that's this part right here. Now, if you want it to appear on the calendar, you type your start date and also put your end date in okay and that will appear on the calendar now you also want to add a featured image so when you do, if if you haven't added the image it'll say add featured image you can click this button it'll take you back to the media file you can choose what photo that you want to appear now you can also click preview changes and here we go here's your events page now this is what I was talking about your featured image it'll it'll appear right here okay and that's about it and then once you are complete you just click update and it goes live so I hope that's helpful to you and uh, if you have any questions let me know